What's up, Marvel fans? This is Dan Sears, and here again for another trailer reaction. So, when I just when I was re obviously recording and reaction to my reaction for the Revel by Night, I had a notification call up saying that Secret Invasion first trailer has popped up, and I've got it up here right now. And hopefully by this point of time, hopefully my Werewolf by Night one should be up and running. If not, I do apologise. You will see it if you haven't watched it yet. Okay, now for the Secret Invasion. I have no idea what I'm spitting. But I've seen, I've, I've been seeing some little glimpses that looks like from the trailer. And I'm going like, nope, no, I don't want to see it. So I'm keeping it as a surprise. Hopefully it gives us like where the timeline is because I heard about oh it's supposed to be set between the five year gap. It's set after Endgame. Well, hopefully this is me. So volume's up. Let's see what happens. So here we go. Here we go. Volume wasn't on for some reason. Yikes. Oh. What the. <laughs> it's just Nick Fury. For years, Ooh. you've been avoiding Earth. I have called for your help Ooh. plenty of other times, and you've been pretty content to let those calls go straight to voicemail. Ooh. Yeah, well, this is different. Ooh. Why is it different? How much do you know about your security detail? What do you mean, how much do I know about it? Oh. War Machine. Oh! Agent Wasp. Fury. Oh. Be very now. Oh. What the? Scrolls. Finally, evil ones. What the? <gasps> oh. You're in no shape for this fight that lies before us. Oh. Henry Coleman. Oh. Oh. This is my war. Alone. Ooh. I'm the last person standing between them and what they really want. Uh, ooh. Ooh. And what is that? Secret invention. Ooh. Oh, next year streaming. Whoa, okay. That looked good, I did. That looked amazing. And, mmm. Very interesting. So I think it looks like uh, the scroll from the Captain Marvel. Well, I mean, from the trailer, it makes it sound like he's evil, but I don't know. I mean, he could be still on the side of good, but. I've got a funny feeling he'll go to his comic book roots when he's a bad guy, Squirrel. Well, I mean, Squirrels are bad guys in the MCU, except for Hawkley. And, well, you know, because he's half Squirrel, half Creeper. No matter. Let's just play the trailer then again so to break down. So, we start off in the middle of a field, and then we see a beam of light dropping down. And then, at first, obviously we see Nick Fury, but at first it makes it look like it's an alien kind of body. You know, like an alien beam, and then obviously when he walks, he looks fo walks forward. It's like, oh wait, it's Nick Fury. <laughs> so, and then we hear Agent Hill. Obviously, we know she was back in it, saying about that. Seems like that Nick Fury's been annoying calls from Earth. So, mm, wonder why he's been doing that. Then obviously, what what goes on in the conversation, and then it sounds like that Nick Fury sounds like that. Um, this obviously from the sound of it, it sounds like that. Oh, he's back here for a reason, like. Like he knows that something's about to go down on Earth. And then we get a glimpse shot of, obviously, Nick meeting up with War Machine. So, obviously, he must be trying to ask him for help. Because, obviously, scrolls and all that, evil scrolls. Then we got, obviously, Ev we got Wasp, obviously, from Black Panther. Um, Evan Wasp. I'm sorry if I'm dodging his first name, Wong. But, yeah, he's back. So, mmm. Wonder what kind of involvement he's got in this. I mean, I mean, obviously, maybe at one point someone's going to take a form of him. One of the scrolls is. Then we got some. Looks like one of the new characters grabbing a gun from the her, one of the brown bags from a black box. Well, whatever. You, it's a box. Obviously, a box in black color. So obviously, it must be a shield agent or something. 
Then we see someone breaking some chains, which could be um, Nick Fury. With a full first, it was Agent. I thought it was um, Agent Wasp, but I think that's um, Ben. Obviously, uh, the Scott. Oh, Tar Wasp. That's it. I think I'm saying his name right. Um, Tar Wasp, the Scroll. Then here, it seems like. Then we got a first glimpse oh, of um, uh, Alina Coleman. Doesn't say in the trailer who she's playing as, but. There's been some rumours saying that oh, she's playing Univan Un Un Jack. Uh, whatever that character, but obviously in the comics it's a male, but looks like if it's true, then they're going for a female um, version of this un in the MCU. But in this room, you've got like some people on like on a, on a desk. Well, I want to call it like a metal kind of table thing. And it's like all these weird kind of blankets on top of them. So I don't know what that is. I don't know if it's something like the scrolls are doing something to them. Or there might be scrolls in their sleep. Then we got Tarwas, like obviously talk, must be talking to Nick. And then we get a glimpse of Tarwas with who I heard this supposed to be with this one person who's supposed to be the main villain. And it looks like people all around him changed into into all his look. So here we are. We get our first glimpse of some evil scrolls, which I've been I've been waiting for since Captain America, well Captain Marvel, because I thought we were supposed to have him in that film, but. Yeah, that didn't happen. Next shot, we get, like, an explosive happen. And so, ooh, maybe the scrolls are starting their attack. Then, obviously, we got Illumin Coleman interrogating some... Must be interrogating someone. Could be a scroll, or maybe... Well, maybe maybe not a scroll. Now, obviously, we got Nick looking at some clocks. And then we got Illumin Coleman's character saying about that, you're not ready. Obviously, what's about to go down and all that. And then Nick going, like, staring in his eye. Looks like some fighting's going on in some meat kind of locker room. And then someone's like burning the doors down. Well, the hand doors down. So it might be the scrolls. Quick glimpse of obviously War Machine with some people. Looks like they're going to an important meeting or this came out of an important meeting. Agent Hill obviously looks like she's about to fire on some scrolls. Then we got our first glimpse obviously at Emily. Obviously the, the female who play, who's the dragon, the dragon girl from Game of Thrones. Doesn't tell you here who she is, but there's still women saying that is she a squall? Is she a maybe a cat? Maybe is she the uh, the um, the ages of well swords um, leader? Obviously the um, that green hair woman. Well, obviously she ain't got green hair hair here, but but who is a mutant as well in the comics? But we don't know yet. Then we got a bit with a crow, a crow like a blackbird making it, doing his thingy noise to Nick Fury, which okay. I don't know what's going on there. Then obviously Nick saying about that um, I need I'm fighting this war on my own, like saying about I prefer to do this on my own, like that kind of thing. Then we got some oh all damage control, so damage control is in here as well. Seen from the back of their jacket from the ones from obviously Spider Man and Miss Marvel, and looks like I'm opening that uh, some silver um, box, but I, I can't tell what it is. I was just trying to pause it then, but. At first, I thought it looks like a face or something, but I don't know. Then we got someone walking into a room of some, looks like they're building something, so it could be some scrolls. And they, on the door, it looks like it's Nazi language, so something's going on there. Then, obviously, um, obviously the actress, Emily. And then we see a scroll in, obviously, in a scroll look, screaming at someone with some people behind them. Then I see Nick Fury. With his uh, beard and obviously that eye patch and well, he's got his eye patch bag and the and a hat. Looks like uh, there's some cars on the um, on the wall on the on the wall and some helicopter blasts a missile, flips one of the vehicles around, and then someone obviously in there is is it obviously oh you know what I mean <laughs> obviously someone in the vehicle is flipped as he also is about to get injured. Don't know who that is. Might be a, the president or so obviously someone who's on the high bid there. And then last bit, we got a glimpse of Nick wearing the black coat again. And we have his hat. Well, he's hooked some kind of hat. So that's pretty cool. Yeah, he got one on. And then we got the title card, Secret Invasion. And then just says about streaming next year. I know we got the um, the reveal of the de well the year, obviously, from San Diego Comic Con. But looks like they still ain't giving us a date. But that's all right. I mean, at least we now, at least we would know that it's out next. It was out next year, so okay, that's pretty good. Um, trailer wise, it looks very interesting. It looks very sinister. -y, it does. I mean, I mean, because obviously we're finally gonna have evil scrolls, like I just said. 
I mean, finally getting the bad scrolls. Um, and it's also going to be hard to tell, like, if we're going to have good scrolls as well, it's going to be hard to tell, like, who's the good one and who are the bad ones, you know? I mean, I would say maybe you are going to get, like, multiple good ones. I mean, we got, like, Tolos, but... I don't know. I mean, Tolos is a bad guy in the comics, but for this one, they made him a good guy from Captain Marvel, but... I would not be surprised in the series that he, he gets Timberney or he gets, um, you know, feel like maybe this guy is white. We should be doing this. Because, I mean, he doesn't even say, like, oh, what's going on? Like, oh, yeah, I found some evil scrolls planning to take out Earth. But obviously, that's from the looks of this, that's telling me that, oh, yeah, we are getting evil scrolls. So that's it from that. So if you want to see this for yourself, I will leave the link down in the description below. So you can see the, um, so you can see the trailer. Oh, hang on, looks like they must have revealed some, oh, okay. I'm just having a quick look at the, um, the D23 on the other stuff, and, oh, looks like something's just come up, and that will come on with my VRO discussion on the, um, you know, details of each of the films and shows. That'll be coming up later on, hopefully today, but it might not be tonight, it could be tomorrow. But yeah, I will leave the link to the trailer down in the description below. Leave your comments down below. What did you think of this trailer? Did you find it interesting? Are you looking forward to it? And give me my own thoughts. Like, do you think the um, this is going to be that? Yes, we are going to have evil scrolls in the series. Because, come on. Come on. It's got to be that. And then give this video a thumbs up if you like the video. Share this out to your friends. So if they haven't, so if they want to watch someone doing for a change on YouTube, show them one of my chat, one of my videos, and if they like it, they can subscribe to this channel to get some new, obviously updates when my new videos are up. And if you're here to see, if you're here, if you're here I mean, uh, I'm sorry, I can't get my words out now because I'm too excited for this, for this I am. Uh, if you are new, that's it. This is this is what I do. I do the Marvel and Transformers Cinematic Universe news. I go with the trailers, Super Bowl TV spots. The San Diego slash D23 stuff. And then the spoiler reviews from the both of them. On just the film side, but I said I was going to do it for the TV for Marvel, but who knows really? Maybe in the future, I don't know. And I don't also I don't do spoilery trailers and clip reaction videos because when they obviously they release them when it comes close to the project and I'm like, nope, I don't want to know more about it. Um, last but not least, if you want to see me weather by night reaction trailer, click here. Hopefully, like I said, hopefully it should be up by then. My channel, make sure you click the bell, it's going to be notified when my new viewers are up. And here to see my last Transformers video. So that's it really guys. So like I said, so, looks like there's more stuff been coming up from D23. I think something's just come up about the Thunderbolts. Like, or oh, maybe some a first look at US Agent. That's all I'm going to say for now. Um, so I hope you enjoy this reaction and breakdown video of the secret invasion thank you for watching and i hopefully you get it you get to see my another video of me talking about all the other projects tonight or tomorrow so i'll see you later peace